Google just released an AI coding agent that is going to disrupt so many industries. So first of all, this AI coding agent is going to completely disrupt the micro SaaS industry because now using this AI coding agent, you can build micro SaaS within literally just a few seconds. Just have a look at this AI code review tool that I just built with just one simple prompt. I needed an AI code review tool. I just gave it simple prompt and then it built a complete AI code review tool without even asking me for any third party services for AI review because this AI coder by google has access to all of the ai models and all of the services inside google ai studio so it doesn't matter what sort of product you want to build this ai coding agent can build everything for you without asking for any third party services because it uses ai models and ai services from google ai studio another industry that this ai coding agent is going to completely disrupt is web-based ai code editors so a lot of you who are non-technical or non-programmers they usually use tools like bold.new or liveable.dev because these tools are so simple and easy to use but the problem is these web-based ai tools always need third party services services so let's suppose if you want to build an authentication system or a backend or maybe if you want to integrate any sort of ai models so you always need to integrate either like superbase or maybe you need to provide an api key to integrate ai but if you use this ai coder by google you won't need any of that and by the way this video is not sponsored by google i really wish they could sponsor this video but if anyone from google is watching i am ready to sell my soul i am not that expensive anyways i generally love this ai code editor you can see on my channel i have reviewed so many ai code editors like web based and native ones and then cli based ai coding agents but this particular ai coding agent is just remarkable because the main thing is it is already integrated with all of the services by google so that's why you don't have to do any extra hassle to like integrate any third party services or like use any sort of like third party api keys because it can manage almost everything by itself so let's just dive deep and let me just show you that what we can build using this ai coding agent so before we start and before we dive deep please subscribe to this youtube channel and click on that like button as well all right so to start using this ai tool just go to google Google AI Studio. Just look for Google AI Studio on Google. After that, simply just open it. And if you have a Google account that you of course have, then you can just like find it in here. So this is Google AI Studio, and you can see you got access to Nano Banana here. You got access to a lot of models and a lot of tools by Google in here. But but to use this AI tool, just go to Build. So in here on this left side, you can just find this Build. So Build Apps with Gemini. So this AI coder basically a Gemini coder. So it is based on Google's Gemini AI model, which is is like fantastic in writing code so here are some sample apps that you can see are built using this ai tool the interesting thing is on each of these apps you can find kind of services are being used by this app so you can see let's suppose this particular app which is media sim so this app is basically using vo3 to like create videos and imagine 4.0 fast to create images gemini 2.5 flash image and then tltra i think so you can see it is using all of these different services by google but because this app was built using gemini coder so that's why the developer just had to like mention that okay use this service and then it is going to use without requiring and asking for any sort of api keys there is this really interesting app which is called paint a place so this is what this app does right now it is showing my address so i'll just like choose something else i'll just look for big ben so this is london's famous big ben if i just click on this create color so now what it will do it will just like make this photo in watercolors using i think nano banana so that is just like mind-blowing for me just have a look at this so it just like created a very high quality watercolor painting using that google maps image which is just mind-blowing by the way all of these apps that were generated using gemini are actually open source so you can just easily like download any of these apps or maybe save them to github so it just works like bold.me or lovable.dev so it is that simple so now let's just go back and let me just show you one of the app that i just created then this app is called gemini code reviewer i'll just created this app so if i just open this app so this is how this app works so if i just provide any code to this app this app will create a review based on that code so this app can review javascript typescript python java c sharp rust html css sql ruby php swift kotlin so all of these different languages are supported by this app so you know what i'm going to do i'm just going to copy this code from here then i'm going to just paste this code in here it's a js code i'll simply just like click on review code and now what it is going to do it is going to review this code and then highlight if there are any of the issues in that code so 
this app i just built by just giving it a simple prompt and this is like a proper professional code review app and i did not integrate any of the third party api keys or anything because it is using gemini to like review this code and also because gemini is one of the best ai models out there for coding so yeah i mean no problem with that so just have a look at this it's a detailed review so it has just identified all of the bugs and errors and also if there is any chunk of code that is going to have performance issue so it has highlighted that as well so this is very detailed code review that it has just generated as i mentioned earlier i was generally looking for an ai code review tool and i just like randomly built one using this tool and now i can just deploy this tool rather than paying for any third party tool so this is just a simple micro SaaS project this is what this tool is really good at if you if you want to build like something really complex and something really high end so of course this tool cannot do that but this tool can for sure build the basic SaaS products so now let's just build something using this tool you can start from a template so if you just click on that so you can just maybe like start from any of these templates there is this prompt template that has the prompt Gemini in this template then there is this live template that allows you to create a live agent using bi-directional streaming so there are all of these templates that you can use to build anything so in this example I'm just going to build this app so this app is going to be an interactive map it might have to use the map SDK so let's just see if it can build this app let me just give it this prompt and now let's just see if it can build this app or not so right now you can see it is planning it is creating a detailed plan for itself before actually starting to code so first it is just like building this plan it is deciding what sort of apis it is going to use so right now it has just like started developing this app and now you can see it is creating a complete project just like bold.new just like lovable.dev but in a way more user-friendly manner so you can see in this file explorer tab you can find all of the files that it is creating all of the components that it is creating and all of the code that it has just generated so this is now what it has created it. that's amazing what i can do i can just mention my city in here and now it is going to search for amazing places inside london so here you can see some of the suggestions the first one is british museum the second one is buckingham palace and then there is tower of london then there is state modern hyde park so all of these main places inside the city of london it has just like suggested me all of these places so you can see i can navigate between map it is like proper interactive map i can move and pan as well that's amazing now if i just click on this plus so now you can see it is added in my day trip if i just like click on plus as well again and it has now added both of these inside my day trip and now you can see it has just like created these location markers as well so now i can like plan more visually that which place i should go first where i should go second and then where i should go next so this is like a proper ai trip planner in real time in like proper 3d so yeah this this just like looks amazing now you can actually just download this source code because simply just click on this button it will allow you to download this source code and after that what you can do you can just open the source code inside cursor or windsurf or something like augment code and then you can just like carry on your further development in there even you can push this code on github as well so if i just click on save to github it will ask me to log into github and you can see i have just logged in and now it is going to create a github repository i'm going to keep that repository private so i have just entered my repository name now what i can do i can simply just click on this create repository and now it will create a github repository once it is on github now i can deploy this project directly on something like versal or on maybe netlify any of those hosting providers in fact i can just like have my own vps hosting from something like hostinger and then i can deploy this project over there so here is my github repository and you can see the complete project is here so now i can just go to versal and i can access my project in here you can see there is this trip planner ai project i can simply just click on import and then directly import this project once once you have deployed your project then you can simply just connect your domain name so let's suppose if you have purchased a domain name from maybe like godaddy or any other like maybe name cheap so you can just like connect your domain name here and within few seconds your project with your own original domain name will be live similarly if you just want to open this project inside vs code or inside cursor or windsurf so this is the source code that i have just downloaded from here so you can see when i clicked on this download this app so now this is the source code that it has created now i can just like open this folder inside vs code and then start using something like Klein or something like Augment Code or something like Kilo Code and then I can just like further continue developing this project in any of those AI code editors. So this is how simple and easy these days is to build complete full stack applications. You can use this kind of tool, you can use this tool and build almost any sort of micro SaaS products.
So just go ahead and give it a try and maybe build something using Nano Banana because Nano Banana is one of the best AI model out there by Google. So just like use Nano Banana to build maybe AI thumbnail generator or something like that. So just build something amazing using this AI tool and do let me know in the comment section what you think about this amazing AI code editor by Google. I see you next video. Bye bye.